I don't want another mother to feel the pain that I have. I just want justice for my son and I want it in the correct way. A mother in the Algonquin neighborhood continues to look for answers after her son was shot and killed last year. This is Wave News at 11. I'm Noelle Friel. Now, almost five months since the deadly shooting, Raymel Atkins' family is continuing to work to keep his memory and case alive. Wave News reporter Alina Noakes has more. Yeah, there are currently 80 unsolved Louisville homicide cases from 2023. Raymond Atkins case is one of them, but his mother wants to make sure her son is not just another statistic. This was his neighborhood. This was his whole neighborhood. All of these kids is the neighborhood. It saddens me to him for him to be in the same neighborhood all of these years to get gunned down on his front porch. In September 2023, Raymel Adkins was shot and killed on his own front porch on West Gobert Avenue. Minuet Adkins is remembering her son for who he was one day after what would have been his 16th birthday. He just was a funny character. We miss his presence so much because every day it was a joke, no matter what the circumstances was. If the house was angry, if everybody was mad, he would fix it. He was the fixer. You know, you don't get this kind of outreach and outpour from someone who wasn't lovable and didn't give love. Surrounded by family and friends at a balloon release, Raymo Adkins' mother wants to make sure both his memory and his case are not forgotten. All I can do is pray and hopefully that they will listen to me because I don't want another mother to feel the pain that I have. I just want justice for my son and I want it in the correct way. February 5th marks five months since the deadly shooting. No arrests have been made and Minuet Adkins is frustrated over what she feels is a lack of communication from detectives in her son's case. Meanwhile, Adkins says she knows who's responsible for her son's death. As she looks for a peaceful resolution to her son's case, Adkins has one message for those she says are to blame. Turn herself in. You know, you when you do adult things, you get adult consequences. You can't run around here doing anything you want without a consequence. Everything is a consequence, and you just have to stand on it. If you have any information that may help in the investigation of Raymond Adkins' case, you're asked to call LMPD's anonymous tip line or submit a tip online. Those can be found on our website at wave3.com. Alina Noakes, Wave News.